That there is a, a serious power to uh, youthful ignorance. That when when you don't know something, that um, it, it can be dangerous, but it can also be really powerful. That like there is a certain uh, timidness that develops uh, when you get older after you develop knowledge. Like a bad boy when. Oh, when you were bad boys? Uh, yeah, like, like that kind of uh, youth. When I was young about that time, I think that was uh, 1995 or something like that. I think, I think it was that. Yeah. But yeah, there was a, um, a, a whole other kind of fearlessness that I had in my, in my youth that I, I even admire that now when I look back. I really admire that uh, uh, fearless power I used to, to uh, command. Thank you very much. All right. Thank Thank you. You. Thank you. Thank you. You know what? It was um, uh, the discovery of how hard it is to play innocence. Um, to, to play like you don't know something. You know, there there is a. Um, there's a look that that uh, young people have in their eyes before they've experienced the heaviness of life, and then once you've experienced it, it's really hard to take that look out of your your eyes. So that was a an interesting thing trying to find that uh, the naivete.
Well, you know, it was, uh, it was a, a really interesting uh, process uh, because the, the young me was a 100% digital character. So uh, I didn't get to see any of the imagery for probably eight months was the first time that I started to see the images of the younger me. And the first time I saw it, I was really... Uh, blown away. It's a it's a strange thing to see yourself do things in be in places that you know you didn't do that and you weren't there. So it's this uh, the the technology is spectacular and uh, what what Ang Lee has done I think is going to uh, really create something uh, new and and spectacular in cinema. In my head, it is doable based on, uh, well, last time I come here, I was with uh, uh, Life of Pi. The experience walking a tiger, I know uh, theoretically it can be done. However, uh, when we watch a human face in a different age, especially your biggest movie star, I don't know how the outcome will be, how that will play in people's head. Um, so that was really the challenge but it's a very exciting process. Painstaking, but very exciting. I hope that excites you as well. Thank you so much. We're very, very happy to be here. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Tokyo. First of all, I want to say our hearts and prayers go out to anybody who was affected by the tragic typhoon. We feel terrible and wish you all the best. Thank you. Mina-san, <laughs> konbawa. No, th this is uh, this is uh, probably my tenth trip to to Tokyo, and I keep having more and more fun uh, every time I come. The last time I was here uh, was for Aladdin, and now we're here to present Gemini Man. So uh, I, I I hope you guys enjoy it as as much as I enjoy being here with you. Uh, you know what what was really interesting is tr trying to capture. Uh, innocence for the younger character. Um, there's a certain uh, amount of knowledge that you have after you have certain experiences in your, your life and you're, you can feel it in your body and it's just in your cells and it's in your eyes. And we were working really hard to make the, the younger character, the junior character, uh, feel innocent and feel uh, naive. So I would say that was the, the most difficult thing, trying to get to capture that youthful innocence. Uh, you know, working with one Will Smith is a great pleasure. Working with two Will Smith is great pain. <laughs> uh, Technology-wise, is is like never done before. Uh, it's mind-boggling how much work people put, put into it to make believe. But uh, just create junior um, to ask this man to act younger is not easy, not because he cannot act younger but, or have a younger heart, but he's a much better actor today than before, and he will want you to know that he's a better actor now. <laughs> uh, so getting to that innocence while take treasure on his uh, great acting ability today, and while we enjoy the charm of his, his biggest movie star before and now, uh, and just technology-wise to catch that, to play in people's head, that's uh, not only is a technical challenge, but it's a wonders, it's, it's a mystery. You know, it, it was um, such a, a, a strange thing because I was playing the scene with sometimes there would be another actor, sometimes there would be a stunt person, sometimes uh, uh, nothing depending on, on what the scene was. But it was, it was eight months before I actually saw what the, the images were going to look like. And the first time I saw the, the character created, it was, it was a beautiful shock. 
you know, and, you know, when you see your, yourself or an image of yourself doing something that you know you didn't do, you know, it, it, it's, a, it's a really powerful um, way to create. What Ang Lee has done, I think, is going to, uh, you'll see in the future of cinema, really push the, the artistry forward. Uh, you know, th this was uh, a dream come true for me to uh, work with, with Mr. Ang Lee. It's a, it's a um, for a good solid 20 years, something I've been uh, dreaming about. So uh, we, we finally had the opportunity to work together, and I am uh, humbled and honored to be on stage with all of you, and I just I hope you enjoy the movie. Ready to miss? It's... Yeah.